Israeli rebels from other parts of Iraq also find their way to Syria to fight the final battle. The Russian Defense Ministry says as terrorists are gathering the most elite forces in Syria's largest city, Deir Ezzor, to assassinate. The Syrian-backed Syrian government troops are also deploying troops in three directions to the castle of Deir Ezzor. This is almost the last fortress of its terrorism still seized in Syria said General Sergei Rudskoy. Mr. Rudskoy said as terrorists were trying to take control of this important city in the final battle with the Syrian army. The most sophisticated is guns are coming to this city. According to our information, terrorist forces from Mosul, Iraq, are also on their way to Deir Ezzor, said General Rudskoy. He said that although as terrorists withdrew most of their forces from the Raqqa stronghold, the unit, called the Syrian Democratic Forces, was unable to fully control the city after three months of siege. At present, a large number of Israeli troops are being besieged in the town of Akarbat in central Syria. This site is expected to be released in the near future. A breakthrough in central Syria came after Suwail al-Hassan's command. He is nicknamed Tiger Tiger and has devised a completely new tactic against terrorism. The new strategy of Syrian government forces allows a city to be freed faster and less costly. The strategy here is made possible through the support of Russian Ka-52 combat helicopters and the lightning strike by the military forces. Thanks to this measure, the center of Syria was recaptured shortly. Currently, a number of his terrorists are being besieged in Idria city, southeastern Syria. His terrorism has been destroyed almost all. Syrian troops are moving into the city and controlling each zone at 30 to 40 kilometers per day, said Rudskoy.